Uh, well, the feeling of course is, is, is elation, but also a lot of uh, panghihilayam because we should, have, we should be going to Madrid. You know, one lucky bounce here, one lucky bounce there. The Croatia game, yeah, Jeff's last shot. Uh, um, Jason's last opportunity against Argentina. Had we, had we uh, converted, uh, we'd be going to Madrid now. So there's just kind of a tinge of regret for that. But at the same time, we know, all of us, even in the country, when we, took, when we saw our grouping, we said our best chance is against Senegal because they're ranked uh, below us. Uh, obviously, they came here and they started playing really much better than their ranking. And so we really thought that we'd have, uh, if we if we'd get a 1-4 record, that would be very well, very, very good for us. Unfortunately, I think we were a victim of our own success. We played so well so early that everyone, including ourselves, everyone in the Philippines, started thinking that, hey, no, we can beat these teams. And we very nearly did. We, we lost four games by, by a total of 20 points. You know, you take away the last three-point shot against Greece, when it, the game was over, we lost four games by 20 points. It's one possession, practically, you know. One big bounce, one good uh, break here, one less turnover there. Um, and so we were right there. So, you know, um, we, we, we showed the whole tournament that we, could, that we belong, that we can compete. And tonight we showed that we could win. What, 40 years was the last time we won in the World Cup. So we just absolutely have no idea. None of my players was even born the last time the Philippines played in, in the World Cup. So we, we just have absolutely no clue. We tried, we practiced for 30 days. We started our practice on July 25 uh, before coming over. So. You know, uh, we try to play some tune-up games and friendly games, but unless you're in this kind of environment, you really don't know what to expect. And I think, and if you even saw it in today's ball game, in the end game, we, we froze, we were freezing. It's not because we're chokers, or not because we're, we ju we're just not used to it. These players, they're all superstars, they're all main players in their teams back home, in their PBA, in their commercial teams, in their professional teams. But you have a professional team here, it's different when you have Philippines here. It's much, much heavier. It's more heavy, so it, it, it takes it takes a lot of getting used to, really. Unlike you know Barea and Bogdanovic and, and, and all the guys that we played, uh, the, the the Greek players, uh, Zizis and all those uh, point guards. They they for them in the end game it was very natural. It was very simple. They knew exactly what to do. So it's not the same with us. And there's, that's not to take anything against my players, it's just inexperience. The only way we'll get it is to actually get it, to, to experience it. So yeah, we'll go back, we'll assess the, what happened, but right now it's just the Asian Games on the run.